oh, I'm just gonna talk to you this close the entire time. No, that would be actually a little bit too personal, I think. What's up, everybody? My name is Christine. I am currently a 19 year old studying design at the School of Visual Arts and I'm very excited to start this YouTube channel. My intention is to make the most out of those files that are eating away at my computer storage and I wanted to have something to reminisce on when I am older. Today I woke up with two missed calls from my good friends Rashida and Philippe at school. But I was actually gonna stay home but I decided not to. I was like okay fine we can go. <laughs> actually I was more like very appreciative of the fact that I have friends who like hit me up and that's actually how long I have it been eager to hang around people <laughs> Rashida wanted to go brunching so we checked out this place called Cafe Orlin or Cafe Orlean I'm not quite sure how it's supposed to be pronounced but it's located uh, in St. Mark's um, across 10 below between 1st and 2nd half and it was really good I paid a stupid price for buttermilk pancakes that I could have easily made at home but hey I think as long as you enjoy something and you have good company it's worth it talked about how we are very excited to be entering our 20s soon. I am turning 20 in March so yeah I think it's just very exciting and just a little you have like bit of the butterflies and just like jitters and like anxiety but also a whole bunch of excitement um from 20 to 30 is when like life is supposed to happen you're supposed to graduate college you're supposed to have your career kick off you're supposed to meet someone who's close to the love of your life and maybe get married to that person and also like maybe have a kid if you're married and like maybe get a house and those are a lot of things and I'm not sure how many of those things I will accomplish in that time span of 10 years but I'm just very excited to see how um, how it's gonna play out I think I will at least accomplish one of those things which is graduating college I will yes I I will like I will and I will also be focusing on my career so hey that's two right it was stupidly 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 cold outside very stupid cold outside so we ran back home and we did a change of outfits then we went back over to Philippa's house and Philippa was chilling and she was eating a bowl of cereal. I was very appreciative of those like 10 minutes in the day and I'm not sure why but I just love those moments when you're with the people you love and you're like yeah I love you and I'm in your house because you love me. <laughs> really like it when we're all together and we're just like not doing anything but we're just there because we're friends and I just appreciate that a lot.
and a thumbs up oh, and subscribe. Get me to a million. <laughs> Thanks. Bye. Moving right along, we went to the Whitney Museum. It was actually my first time at the Whitney Museum. So I think I was just very like excited and nervous and also very ashamed that I was my first time there. And I'm actually a very shitty New Yorker, but hey, whatever, I went, right? <laughs> and it was really good. Um, I think one of the things was I accidentally spilled coffee on a lady's butt and gave her tissues to clean up. I felt really bad. <laughs> and I also really enjoyed everything that was going on. Uh, the Dreamlands, in a nutshell, I guess was very psychedelic, um, very like what you would see in an EDM music video. I just is what I feel like. <laughs> and, but it was just all done in film, all done in film, projected onto the walls or whatever installation that was up. And I believe one of the rooms is very pink and it had very Drake, Hotline Bling music video vibes. That music video is actually inspired by an artist named James Terrell, I believe. I just wanted to give a random fact because I do believe that it's very important to give artists credit where it's due and they don't get that like big fame as like big celebs do, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, we just really enjoyed the Whitney. Oh, we were also with um, Philippa's friend from Portugal and it was our first time meeting so it was a little awkward he was kind of shy but that's okay we still had a really good time and i then we just took the stinky metro back home so yeah i think i just washed up and i went to go see the devil wears prada for the first time with my friend rashida because she lives in the same building and yeah I'm actually filming this part of the video like tomorrow so like the next day and just like telling you what happened because I tried to film this yesterday and I didn't like how any of the footage turned out and I'm a bit of a perfectionist so I decided to refilm everything and so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in no time bye